Steve, first of all, uh, your reaction to a, a team's effort to produce a Game 7, uh, no matter at what cost? Well, pretty resilient effort, I thought. Uh, you know, I thought from the first puck drop, we, we seemed to have our legs and seemed to be attacking the game. And, you know, unfortunately in Toronto for a couple of those games, we didn't attack the way we should have. So it was nice tonight that we did that and really dictated a lot of the pace of the play, and that's what we have to do. You got the first goal again, 13th time you've done that consecutive, but do you feel your effort was better building off of it tonight? Yeah, you know, again, it's nice to get the second one eventually because we know how good a team that we're playing. So uh, to get the first one was great. It backed them off a little bit, but we've got to continue to press at that point, John, as he said, and make sure that we find that second goal. Uh, is there ever underestimating the effort Drew McIntyre puts in? Boy, you know what? Uh, we had Johnny Bauer drop a puck at our rink a couple of nights ago, and I think he started his career late. And I'll tell you what, what Drew's doing right now is just fantastic. And not only helping our hockey club, but he's, he's making, a, I think, a big case for his own personal career as well. Taking nothing away from uh, Drew's play, but uh, you played those five on threes pretty good positionally. Yeah, you know what, uh, Kenny, Ryan, obviously Jerry D'Amigo, and you really got to appreciate a Petter Granberg when you watch him out there. I think, you know, the way he can go down and take away seams and take away passes, he's tremendous at it. He's done it at the at the Men's Worlds. He's done it at the World Junior, and you can see why he's a gold medal winner. Trevor Smith talked about uh, a lot of guys now facing their first game seven. That'll be another step for a young team. Yeah, you know what, it's, uh, it's great. It's great for these young guys. You know what, it's going to be new territory for a lot of them, but... You know what, uh, that's what this year has been all about. It's, it's been putting these boys in, in situations that maybe they weren't used to. Some of them have some experience with junior, but to do it at this level in a conference final, you can't write a better script for the young development of our kids. How about that breaker was that third goal for, you think, for them to get that one right before the end of the second period? Well, that, it was big, especially uh, they were coming pretty hard. But, you know, when you got a, when you got Spencer Abbott with a puck on a stick like, like that, uh, he, he made a play that not many guys can make in this league, and that was a huge goal for our team. You're absolutely right. Offensively, you were, you know, waiting for some guys to step up. You have Ashton and Smith do it tonight. Uh, was there ever a doubt that those guys would come through for you? Well, you know, at some point, Carter was going to break out. He had been real good coming into the series, and timing's everything. And you know what? Uh, I, I tried to pull some of Trevor's minutes back. I didn't use him as much on penalty kill tonight, so uh, I think we've been riding him pretty hard. So we'll have to look at that again tomorrow night. A couple of times people have said tonight that your team is so young that maybe they don't understand the gravity <laughs> of a game six or seven, and that maybe that works in your favor. It does. You know what? Uh, sometimes being a little naive can be good. And you know what? It's great because now, uh, we're going to go into Game 7. As you said, it's new ter territory for us, and, and I like being on the road. I, I've liked it all year. Uh, we're a team that is resilient, and they seem to find a way, so it should be an exciting game tomorrow night. For two rounds, you played seven games. Now you get seven against one team. Yeah. That's what you expected coming in? We knew at some point we are going to deal with adversity. We knew it, uh, and it's great. You know, it's where you want to be. It's given us a chance to get to a Game 7, and once you get in these situations, believe me, I, I've been on a bench in one-goal games, <laughs> one, <laughs> so I know exactly what we're dealing with. Thanks, Thanks Thank you, Steve.